Hello, hello. I'm back out here looking at a bed that Frank put in with um, potatoes and onions. As you can see, the potatoes are coming up nicely. And we also have some onions here coming up around the outsides. Uh, it's mostly sand in this air one. He's just checking to see how well they can grow in here. Oh, I see the our little trees are bouncing back. Oh, that one's bouncing back really nicely. Let's take a look, see? I don't have any shoes on. Just gotta watch out for the raspberry bushes. Looking nice. And the raspberries are, oh, my shadow. Got a bunch of flowers on them. That's all crazy. I don't know how well the rose bush is doing. It looks like it's doing all right. You can see this bunch of roses there starting. Yeah, I really gotta cut this back. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna park on the sidewalk. Come back this way. <laughs> Just so I don't get any things in my feet. Okay, good. And um, I don't know if my strawberries came back this year up here. But I will take a short peek. Oh, geez, almost fell. We do got some wild strawberries as you can see. I don't know if you can see that actually. Yeah. But uh, let's see. Oh, they did come back. And there's a strawberry right there. It's not weird yet. There's this one back. And this one back. And it has a strawberry too. And a bunch of wild strawberries in there. And ooh, blueberries. Oh, there's some strawberries. Oh, freaking flies coming at me. <laughs> they love to bite me. I think it's because I'm. Oh, I'm going to pick these ones here. Pick these strawberries that's just right here. Okay. And as you can see, we got lots of blueberry. Go away, flies. I don't know if you can see them. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Well, this is like we've had so much rain. We're supposed to get more rain. And this is kind of like a pause between. I thought I saw blueberries that were actually blue up here but I guess not hmm. wait if I come back on this side where was I oh wait there okay looks like yeah there's some starting to turn blue as you can see all right so that's the air side we'll head back over to the other side of the house to take a look at the garden there hello hello we're back over here as you can see there's lots of stuff going on some harvesting is needed. I think we will start um, at that end. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> okay. So at the back of the kennel here, we have some uh, potatoes growing. As you can see, and I just planted some beans at the back behind them. So got potatoes up front here. Going. Sorry about my shadow. And at the back we have some beans. Inside the kennel we have onions coming up. There's nothing except onions in this here section. And over here we have onions and more pole beans. As you can see, the peas, set this down for a second. The peas are starting to flower. I don't see any pea pods yet. And we have a ton of tomato, um, oh, that actually there's an onion there too. These are all volunteers. Oh, there's a bunch of onions in there and tomato plants. I gotta pull some of these out. And I gotta pull out these too, yeah. But, you know, they come out very easily. So that's gonna be easy to do once the dry weather comes. But uh, yeah, see we're starting to get strawberries on the strawberry plants also. Oh, these weeds come on out. Silly things. Oh, look at this beautiful looking strawberry plant here. Uh, yep, some strawberries starting on that one too. Anyway, so the peas look great. Lots of flowers on that end. Let me grab this little basket of mine. Let me just move. And these are baskets, as you can see. We have potatoes starting to come in. I can't remember what kind uh, in each thing. We got a few different kinds of tomato plants. Man, I mean, look at this. 
See that? That's like, let me pull it out. Look at the sheer amount of tomato plants right there. That's a ton. Bunch of volunteers. These guys are thick and healthy, aren't they? These are the best peas I've ever had. I got them sown in there thick and they came great. There's some more here. They're not as tall. I think these are the dwarf ones I planted. I'm not sure. Still got to do some weeding. All these here, guys. Um, the ones that got frost damage. Oops, sorry about that. Right here, bounce back for the strawberries. So that's great. These guys are looking great. Absolutely looking great. I don't see any pods yet, though. On the peas. So, yeah. You can see tons of flowers on these guys. I can't remember exactly what kind those ones are, but there's tons of flowers on them. I know for a fact those are the blush, though. Okay, that's that. Over in Yuri's bed, all oh, this stuff is coming back, as you can see. Uh, we have, let's see, these carrots seem to be doing fine. Uh, this is an okra we put in there, but something's been chewing it up. These are just uh, wagers. I want the seeds, pods. Uh, oh, wait, fly. Off my face. Garlic's doing all right. And um, I can't remember what I planted there, but it's growing. Whatever it is. Nothing came up in this yet. This was um, honeydew melon. There's nothing up yet. Uh, raspberries back there. I gotta clean up that. Uh, can't really take a look at them right now. Blueberries are looking great. And as you can see, we have more potatoes coming up. Along with onions in the back. Blueberries looking nice now. Bouncing back nicely. And that one's bouncing back nicely. Um, did I have anything in this? Not yet. Uh, zucchini's gonna go in here, I believe. Or in that one. It's either peppers, zucchinis, peppers, and peppers, I think, and peppers. But not yet. Just doing the house. I have an eggplant here. Getting ready to put in the ground. Uh, all the garlic is looking great. I got some scapes off. Oh, looks like I need to pull some more scapes off these here smaller ones. Um, yeah, they look uh, fairly good. Just gonna grab you anymore. I'm sorry, let's, uh, let's zoom out some so it's a little easier to control. So yeah, they look pretty good, huh? I'll get those scapes later. Oh yeah, see, as you can see, they're fairly t well off. And some of these guys are thick. I do got some weeds too that needs to come out of there. Flowers are growing. Things are eating them too at the same time. Borage. Hairs. Looking good. Um, what are you? Marigolds, I believe. Some flowers. Other things I can't remember. Other type of flowers. We'll just have to wait and see. Oh, I obviously put a lot there. Gotta wait and see what that is. Inside we have cucumber stuff ready to go on the ground. Peppermint is doing all right. Needs to be watered. I'm surprised that this chicory is coming back. And this lemon balm is looking beautiful. Go away flies. Why are you eating me up? And more onions. Onions. And onions in that little basket and onions in this little basket. Nothing in here yet. Might put some radishes or something in there. Second sowing of radishes. So, in the next bed, um, I can't remember what's in these. I think these are also potatoes, but they're not up yet. We got a bunch of lettuce and as you can see there's some carrots, volunteer carrots coming up. Lots of lettuce. There's some that didn't come up just yet. Might not ever come up. And we have Swiss chard and kale. Bunch of different kale. And that I think is mustard green. So I'm going to let that go to seed. Must, uh, garlic, more garlic, more carrots. Uh, still kind of small. I think it's because of all the weeds. Uh, we're going to take care of it. Radishes and turnip. Radishes and turnip. 
Those are going to be coming out and the tomatoes are going to be going in. Um, I do got some bush beans that I just planted in, in half this bed. I'm going to be taking those out. Beets. Oh, there's another volunteer lettuce plant. My goodness. Where are you guys coming from? <laughs> yep, and sorry about my shadow again. And we got little, little onions. Itty bitty onions coming up. This is, I believe, cantaloupe. As you can see, my herbs are definitely bouncing back now. Sage, oregano, rosemary. No, not rosemary. That's lavender. Um, oh, okay. That needs to be cut. Oh, strawberries. Okay, that's a uh, sorry. That is my brain is not working the best today. I think it's because I'm so tired, lack of sleep and all. What is that? Parsley, of course, parsley. <laughs> that is starting to bounce back. My um, rhubarb, random flowers in there, all bouncing up. More potatoes in that bucket. At the very back, I put I just put some ground cherry seeds. I have some squashes and watermelons that's just coming up here. Um, a small variety. There's a couple large ones. I just want to see how they do. There's a random kale. Uh, I got some radishes back there just to keep them off this. Um, butternut squash and I just put in pumpkin seeds as you can see back there there's some corn coming up all these uh, potatoes are also coming up along with the onions at the back I did just throw some random seeds in the front there's one right there actually that came up and one right there that came up I just want to see what would happen oh well we shall see what happens go away fly and as you can see we got my asparagus which decided to pop up too, just in random places down in the grass. I was quite surprised. I thought there was no more of that. Go away. They like to try to go in my ears for some reason. And I think that's all that's out here. Did I miss something? Probably not. So, we'll go inside and you'll see some stuff in there. Well, as you can see, I got some plants up here. This is just a um, small peppermint plant I stuck in here. I had a pepper plant in this during the winter and after it exhausted all the peppers off of it, uh, I put I threw in a piece of peppermint and as you can see start taking off. These are some peppers and tomato plants I got in here. Some basil too. I have to we plant most of them. Oh, oh. looks like this vehicle coming in the yard. Hopefully the dogs don't bark too much. And I think there's some, yeah, there's a little bit of kale back there. I put some kale in there as backups for outside, but they seem to be growing well outside, so I might not have to replace them down here. I got some cabbage and broccoli stalks. Uh, these are leek right here in the front. Shut up, camera. And I got some herbs at the back, um, dill and, uh, I can't remember what else I put in. Over here I had some backups for lettuce and stuff, but, uh, they went well outside and for some reason they didn't germinate too well inside this year, but they're doing great outside so I don't have to worry about that. What else is here? Um, some time there but down here is just some flowers the dogs has been eating my flowers however eat all my borage um oh you look like you need some water marigolds uh chamomile uh yeah marigolds <laughs> more marigolds back there it looks like there's echinacea that's doing well back there can't really see it Actually, let's 
turn you sideways. No. Oh, there we go. That's echinacea. Uh, yeah, that's echinacea over there too. This is marigolds way right here. They need watering also. I haven't watered them yet today, so that's why they look pretty damn. Although these were sunflowers that didn't do so well. As you can see, they might bounce back. The ones outside are doing great, so I don't gonna really worry about them. Oh, and down here we have some. Those are cucumbers, and those are cucumber melons. I have to put them in the tent though, so that they do better. This is gonna be going outside also. And like I said, I gotta pot up these plants. Hello, it's a different day t today. Since yesterday, I had harvested some radishes and garlic scapes and beet greens of the garden. Today I thinned my lettuce and my Swiss chard and kale. So I got a pot there I'm going to cook up for dinner tonight. Uh, that's going to be going in the fridge and I'll be eating that tomorrow. And I will be doing a update on my grow tent tomorrow because I will be taking my my sweet potato slips and planting them. Hmm. What's going on here? Yeah, and <laughs> I got that pot down there to repot some of this stuff. Oh yeah, look at those. Yeah, so you got some big old tall things down there. Yes, baby, what's up? There's a wolf. You gonna shoot the wolf in the game? <laughs> so that's the end of this air video for now. Yeah, baby. Mommy's gonna start dinner somewhere. <laughs>